Warning, no good comics were harmed in this video. Hello everyone, welcome to Whack, uh, fucking Whack Comics, I'm here with my cunt as always, and we got the fucking Taco Pops, Taco and Crutchman themselves, how, how you all going? Fucking thank you so much for coming and getting whack. No oh, worries. <laughs> Why do you think he calls me his cunt? That's fucking bullshit. <laughs> that was very unexpected, it was bloody hilarious. Here's my cunt. You used to say cunt co-host, and now I'm just cunt. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad that you've noticed. That. What did I do to deserve that? Shut up. We're doing a whack hack. We're doing uh, how to improve Funko Pops. We all love Funko Pops. I've got some here, probably a little bit more than uh, Taco and Pops. Maybe just a couple more. Uh, Tyler's got one there. But we're going we're gonna to improve them. They could use a little bit of improvement from time to time. I'm gonna, I might go first. I've got um, Power Girl. Uh, Power Girl Pop Vinyl I'm going to improve. And uh, the one thing I really don't like about the pop islands is they don't have a mouth. So I think I might just make a mouth for her, okay? So I want to keep the box. So I'm not going to destroy the box, all right? I'm just going to take, take it out of the back like this to keep the box, to keep the box you know, sturdy and stuff. Now we're going to get our uh, pen. I've got a pen here. And I'm going to draw a mouth on uh, a power girl. Let me give her a nice big smile. Oh, yeah. You can even yeah. have them be happy or sad. Yeah, you could do whatever you want. And I reckon she's a little bit cheeky, so I'm going to give her like a bit of a tongue hanging out the side too. Yeah. Oh. She, she does, she does look cheeky. Yeah, definitely <laughs> cheeky. And um, one thing I really don't like about pop vinyls is they don't have pupils. So I'm going to, I don't know if this is going to work, but I've got a metallic silver pen. So I'm going to try and do a, a pupil type thing. See if oh, it yeah. works. You can't see without pupils, really. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. There's some people. Oh, oh wow. That's sexy. Smiling. Oh, that man. is way better. Man. <laughs> and, and then you could, all you need to do is do the same on the box, you know? Just a uh, quick little pupils to the box. And we'll get our pen back out and do a quick smiley face for the box. And like that and then we just put it all back together hang on that's 100% an improvement. Back together. yeah that's definitely an improvement wow and it's, it's it's improved and you can do this with any funko any any funko i've noticed that some of them have a mouth like this one here sort of has a bit of a mouth with his goatee yeah. sort of thing so he probably doesn't need the mouth he probably just needs some pupils so, uh, any ones that don't have mouths at all, just uh, draw it on. Make sure you keep the box uh, good as well, because that's what most resellers value. You're like selling a, a, pump, a Funko Pop, people want to see that the box is in good condition. So, hundred yeah. <laughs> percent. That, that, that's minty. Minty, minty. So, uh, how how do you how would you guys improve a Funko a Funko Pop vinyl? We don't have one in front of us at the moment, but I've, we've always had this idea because, you know, there's metallics, there's flocked glows. So we would like to implement jugs onto the, the Funko Pops and uh, they would be called the wet variants because if you squeeze the jugs, it would the pops actually perspirate. So yeah, we would like to see that in the future. We really want to see that. Really jugs, bad. that's yeah. great. And yeah, wet. Can, on, on every Funko? All Funkos, yeah. yeah, including the males, uh, including creatures, and we're talking dragons, the whole lot. DBZ characters, they, they're all going to have jugs and they're all squeezable. Yeah. Maybe you could uh, demonstrate to us what that would look like. Um, basically, we've got nothing really to mold the jugs uh, with. Just use yourself. I don't know. If you, if you picture just like some nice water balloons like okay. nice. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna say we're, we're gonna give the Funkos probably a nice uh, C cup. Yeah, give them a C. Give them a C yeah. cup. But yeah, mainly just not nice rounded jugs, soft, um, and and very pressable. And uh, just <laughs> just like the light up Funkos where you got the little space to to press. The same deal. You got two holes where the nipples are. You give them a nice poke, and perspiration's your gift. <laughs> oh, yes. Wow. And, yeah, and yeah, that yeah. could work if you're thirsty too. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. If you've got your your parched palate, squeeze the tits, you're done. Yeah, 
That's amazing. Breast. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you could suckle them if you want. Yeah, definitely. I'll definitely do that. God, what a variance. Oh, they need to make them. <laughs> the, the new chase. Everyone will be chasing the tits. <laughs> oh, the chase variant will also have a uh, squeezable crack. Oh, yeah, yeah. So the chase is squeezing the crack. Oh, I know. I oh, know. That is genius. Genius. What kind of milk comes out of there? Oh, that's. Yes. I'll leave that to the imagination, yeah. my friends. Yeah. Oh, Naughty like milk. Naughty milk. <laughs> wow. The best milk. <laughs> That's uh, that's amazing. I'd definitely love to see those improvements Man, good. Uh, come to life on a pop vinyl. Uh, Tyler, my cunt, what have you got for us? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So the first thing is I, I, I'll show you my uh, A Funko Pop. This isn't the one I'm using. <laughs> but you see, the heads don't turn as much. And then, like, there's no articulation on the limbs, which has uh, always bothered me on Funkos. I want it, I want the head to be able to turn all the way around. So what I'm going to do is I take a piece of paper out of a comic book. My favorite comic book. I was oh, wow. out. And then what I do is I'll take I'll remove limbs and I'll remove the head or whatever I need to, whatever I think it needs more articulation, and I'll use this for the limb to give it more articulation. I actually already have one since I do this to all my Funko Pops. Yeah. This is the Predator. <laughs> oh, wow. As you can see, I, I already did it to the head. So now the head can turn and it can Dude, like no. it can bend in different ways. I, I, want I, that. I can look in different directions now instead of just fucking straightforward like a fucking bitch. Like, how's the Predator going to fucking beat anybody? How's the predator gonna fucking beat anybody when he's just looking fucking straightforward? He's got to look around and shit. So he look, Dude, and then this is a game changer. That's man. a game changer. I also hate that his like legs don't bend, so he can't run very fast. So now he's got a knee, so he can like chase after Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh yeah, and he can look <laughs> around and find him. So this would be what how I would improve Funko Pops, give them more articulation, and if you can incorporate comic books, it's a win-win. That's a lot more poseable than it was before. Yeah, that's it definitely. is. That's a fact. Dude, that's a limber pop vinyl. Dude. Genius, genius. Yeah. This, this, this is some crazy <laughs> uh, pop vinyl whack hacks. We've never dabbled in the whack hack. Uh, pop vinyl category before, but we might have to do it a little bit more often because this is like, look at that. You're so well, you good. got the geniuses with these. These are genius. I know. Thank. We could have done it without you guys. So I just want to say though, thank you. I could have done it. <laughs> <laughs>